We use a lot of electric in the cafe, which is all the fridges, the fans, the coffee machines. So we've had 45 solar panels installed on the roof. So what that means is that we're not relying so much on the wood pellet boiler, that we can use the solar panels to power all the electrical items that we have in the cafe and even the events that we run upstairs as well we use those because we've got all the music equipment the lighting and um, the fans that we have running throughout the year just to keep it nice and cool hi my name's emma shepherd and i'm center coordinator at the Ennerdell center we've got two batteries so we have those running the solar panels are obviously powering the batteries up so when it's not as nice of a day and the sun's not shining then we can rely on the battery power as well. We're not paying any more for electric than what we were this time last year so given the current state of play with energy increases we haven't noticed any of that so yeah we are fortunate in that respect. We've just signed up with the new energy providers so that we will be getting paid for that back because the batteries can only store 100%. Once those are full then we, we will export some back into the grid and we have just signed up with the new energy providers. So, so the whole project was just over £40,000 and that was funded by grants from the Lake District Foundation and from Copeland Community Fund. Yeah we're constantly looking of ways to improve what we're doing for the um, sustainability really. We've got, we did get an electric vehicle charger point installed with the funding that we need more work on that to get that up and running but that will be a huge asset especially during the summer months when we have a lot of tourists that come because there aren't any other electric charging points within a five mile radius. Yeah we would love to become more sustainable um, especially with what we use in the cafe. We use so much milk it's unbelievable so our ideal would be to have um, a milk cake system where we get that installed so that we could have people to come collect them they could use the glass bottles to come and fill those up and then we can use the milk in the cafe as well so because coffee is our absolute biggest seller so to get a, to have our own milk refill station would be ideal